Stay hooked, stay hooked, stay hooked. Stay hooked. Oh, it's a big one. Yeah, yes. Oh, it's a good one. The race is on. Wow, Matt's really taking off over there. He must think he's got something going on. He does. Josh. I got a beetle. I got a beetle. He don't know what he's doing. What's up, man? What did I say? That? I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> How's it going, everybody? I, don't, I can't talk anymore. Uh, Josh and uh, Matt's taking off because he thinks he's better than us. But uh, we got a little tournament going on. Three-way uh, tournament. $10 on the line, which I have $6, so I better not lose. <laughs> uh, we're out in Melton Hill. Going to do some fishing. And um, just a little friendly tournament. We got about four and a half hours that we're doing. Five hours almost. Five hours. Five, hours. five. Big, five biggest fish. Yep. I gotta take a picture on my board. Five biggest fish. So I don't know what's gonna happen. Hopefully I catch some fish. I've been here what like four or five times. I've never had a good day fishing out here. So today's the day. I feel it. Don't feel it coming on. Us. Yeah. <laughs> today is the day. All right, here it comes. Here we go. Going that way. He's going that way. That's going that way. I'm going this way. Cross. Look up. Okay. Got three rods with me. I'm gonna come over here and hit these little coves. Work my way that way since we got five hours. Well, we gotta be back at the brand for five hours. And uh, I don't know, fish should be pretty active. Whew, I'm winded from paddling all the way over here. Got a spinner bay, I got a little jerk bay, and I got a yellow dinger tied on. So hopefully we can get some fish out of here. <laughs> Nothing but giants here. All right, it's gotta be 12 inches. Pulled it off a tree, little yum there. Saw him come up and eat it. Went back in this cove and had to get all the way back into it to get one. So, at least that worked out. All right. Oh, wow. I don't know if this guy's gonna be long enough. Not long enough. Oh, he's bleeding. He was a quarter inch under length. Oh, I got one. I got one out of the brush back there. I don't know how big it is, but he's stuck in the weeds. <laughs> I think I got a fish. I was dragging it through that um, moss like a frog or something and something bit it. Is there a fish in there? Uh, take that back. I got nothing. I thought I had a fish. Pretty sure I had a bite. I don't know. Could be making up stuff. Ooh, there's one. Eat it. I saw a fish. Man, I got a fish. It's another little one. Okay, well, there's some little ones active. I saw him come out and look at it. That's two pretty quick. Now let's just get something over 12. Wait, I don't think there's all tore up. Yeah, yes. Oh, it's a good one. That's a solid one there. Oh, that's awesome. That was such a cool catch. Yes. <laughs> that was a cool catch. All right, man, Josh. Y'all better step up your game. It's early in the day and I got a good one. I wonder what they're doing right now. Probably just casting, wasting time. Oh, there's a man over there. Better not show him my fish. Hey, that's a good start. I'm already having the best day I've had on this lake. Ever, I think. <laughs> Let me get him measured. And, oh, we're going for best five over 12 inches. 16. That's a good fish. Boom. All right, get it in there. Now, like I said, this is a kind of a this is just a fun little 
tournament that we're only putting in ten dollars a piece so the winner gets the winner wins twenty dollars so uh let me show you what's crazy what's so cool about that catch is that i barely saw this fish i came out of this cove and i'm just working my way down this bank with these overhangs and it's pretty shallow up in there but i throw up under one of these bushes over here i don't know which one it was and my lure was kind of caught and it was just barely dangling in the water and i just see like a dark object like come up to my lure never felt nothing just barely pulled on it and it just felt tight and i just set the hook on it so they are hanging around this brush i think i got to get those casts way up in there let's keep at it Oh yeah. Oh no. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, that's two really quick. Doing the same thing. Oh yeah. This is gonna work. Definitely figured something out. Not really too hard to figure out, I guess, but. Hopefully this is a 12 inch. Oh yeah, he's 12. He's only 12 and a half, but keeper number two. Dude, this is fun. I like when I can catch fish. Yep. Okay, that worked out just right. This, I'm in a really shallow area. I'm like rubbing on like some kind of growth that's growing up right here, like two or three foot of water. I've seen some little bass. I started throwing my yum dinger and like jerking it across the top and the bass came and exploded on it. So I may have to try a frog or a couple things like this and cover some water through here. It's just now 12 o'clock. I've already caught three keepers. It's pretty good. I got another turn. I got this, I got a real tournament coming up next or uh, this weekend. Hopefully I can. Get the fish like this. this that's the way i'm gonna find the target them is real shallow and hopefully they'll be in there so i'm gonna try a couple different lures in this shallow area see if i can pull out any more that are hiding in this uh grass or whatever this stuff's called down in there i want to go with a frog but i definitely don't have the right rod for it i got a medium heavy but i want to throw it see if they hit it i'll throw a frog and if they get hits on it and i miss them, i may have to try something else Oh, when they're hitting it, they're hitting it pretty aggressively. It's a little guy. <laughs> I skipped it up under there and he came out and just attacked on it. Ooh, came around this corner and the wind hit me too. Try to go down this, uh, up in this cove. It's really windy right here. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. That's a good one. I, oh. <laughs> okay. That dude is fired up. My goodness. Oh, he's so good. <laughs> he hit that thing so hard. He, he was hanging out right in here. So, boom. This is like, uh, like two minutes of throwing the pink one. It came out. I thought I saw something. I made a couple of like twitches and then he hit it. Dude, these guys are strong today. Sometimes you catch these fish in the, especially in the, when it's cooler and they're so lethargic and sometimes they are just full of energy. Keeper number four, 14 and a half. These aren't bad fish. These are, they're solid. As long as, uh, you know, Matt or Josh doesn't catch like a, uh, you know, 20 inch or something. I think I'll be doing pretty good. And then I could catch a big one too, though. All right, this, uh, this pattern is definitely working. Getting it up under there, because they are coming out of these little areas where it looks like there's nothing, but they're holding really tight to that. I think if I was through other lures, maybe I'd get some different fish, but the fish that I'm targeting are definitely tucked away. So, and it's working. I've been getting bites and been getting little fish come out. So they're definitely up in there. And I think some big ones can be up in there too. Eat it, eat it, eat it. He's got it. Oh, come on. Did he get it? Oh, 
oh my goodness, I saw a fish come out. <laughs> that was the next cast after I caught that fish. I saw a bass come out, like nibble at my bait. He's right there, I can see his dark, I can see a dark spot, like kind of right there. He just like, he just like barely nibbled at it. He didn't eat it. Oh, there he goes. Got it that time, there. Oh, man. He didn't have it all the way in his mouth. He barely hit at it. That was the next cast after I just caught that one. This cove right here looks really good. There could be a lot of fish up in here. Yep. There we go, got that one. I saw my whole lure disappear that, oh. He came off. I saw my whole lure disappear that time. I thought I had him hooked. This looks like a good frog spot. Let's try the frog again. I want to get a hit on this frog. Yes! Yes! Stay hooked, stay hooked, stay hooked. Stay hooked. Oh, it's a big one. It's a big one. Stay hooked. Oh no! Oh. oh, didn't get him hooked. That was like a four pounder. So should I throw the frog? So this is what you get when you have the wrong setup. This isn't a, definitely a frog setup. It's a six and a half foot. It's a medium heavy. I just bought a new rug that I want to be able to throw frogs. And I don't have a reel on it yet, but I got a, like a heavier casting rod. I learned a good lesson right there. That would have, fish would have definitely been in. I don't know, we're gonna, we're gonna stay with it. I'm gonna try it again, cause he hit that thing so good. I got it. Oh, no, 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 no. Back to the yum dinger. Got another fish. Let's see if he's long enough. I need this one to be 12 to be my fifth fish. Doesn't look very long. And nope. 11 and a half. Oh, I got it. I think that's the, oh, it's a good fish. Oh, I think that's the fish that I had missed twice. Um, I came back around kind of through this cove and hit that same spot again. And he hit it right away this time. I'll take it. 15 and a half. Man, this has been a solid day of fishing. If I'd have landed that in back there, I think he was over 18. He could have been a 20 incher. I don't know. But I know that I'm gonna catch some more the way this is going. That's my fifth fish and that's a solid limit. It's one o'clock. We got, got uh, almost three hours left. This is gonna be awesome. He's got a hold of it. Oh, get off there, Gar. Usually I wouldn't mind trying to snag a Gar, but that's a little one. And I'm fishing a tournament right now. I'm on a roll catching bass. So. I wonder what I'm gonna spend my money on. You know, what am, I, what am I gonna do with all that $20? Mexican, Oh Charlie's. You know, it's gonna be food, I'm sure. Man. He was in super shallow. That, that's yeah. what was crazy. That's awesome. Yeah. But I'm gonna work on back that way, I guess. And go back up to that one spot that I like, and then it'll probably be, it'll be a stop by then, I'd say. Good luck, man. Two, we got two hours left, so. Yeah. All right, man. Oh, there we go. 
wait you know just a couple minutes since i got a bite but um i've been out and i'm glad about to go into a new cove this is a big one here probably by the time i get done fishing all this and it'll be about time for it to be over and uh i think i can get a few more out of here kind of was on a rhythm there for a while but i think it was just you know just that's where the fish were that's why i was getting bites and then um i've kind of fished a couple walls not a lot and hopefully i'm about to get into an area where some more fish are I hadn't got a bite for a minute and um i was like well let me change to this little uh rebel uh minnow here first cast with i got a fish it's kind of weird I, I was getting all these bites consistently and then i haven't got any good bites or haven't really got any bites in a little while so i'm gonna change up but we're just gonna keep moving i don't know if it was the area or the time of day sometimes the lure but i got a fish on the first cast with this lure so let's see what happens Go. Uh, don't think it's gonna be long enough, but we're back on the fish catching trail. I think the main thing is staying shallow. Yeah. There we go. I got thumped it. Is it gonna help me out? Got flies buzzing me. Alright, he's at least I think a keeper. I don't remember what my smallest one is now. I think it's 12 and a half. He might not beat that. It may only be 12. Only 11 and a half. Three eighteen. Not much time left. Uh, I'm gonna go a couple different lures. Well, I'm gonna change one lure. So I'm gonna try a buzz bait around some of these areas. Just see if something comes out. And I'm just gonna change up my color. I've been going through a few different Yumdinger colors. I'm gonna go back to a dark color. And um, I got five. If I'd have landed the one on the frog, I'd be feeling super confident. Since I didn't get that one, my biggest is 16 something, and the smallest is 12 something. So I got all in between. I'm still feeling pretty calm. I think I'm gonna walk away with the money. I don't think the other guys got it done. So I got a little bit fishing. Hopefully I can get one more to secure this. And uh, we'll, we'll find out what they got here in just a minute. Oh, I got a fish. Is it little one or big one? Oh, he's stuck in the trees. Oh, I think he's little, but... Ah, he's little. There's like three minutes left. It's almost four o'clock. Uh, I can see the ramp, but nobody's there. So I, I don't know where the other guys are at. Um, if I could catch one more really quick, it'd be helpful. Threw right in there, he hit the right, as soon as I hit the water. All right, got a few more casts here and then I got to turn around and head across the right over there about 500 yards come on give me one more give me one more oh. after i talked to you it was pretty slow dude yeah like 
a lot. I caught a couple like little bitty ones after that, and that's about it. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, on a, on a rail cast. Wow. That was a grind. So I think I caught maybe eight fish, seven or eight. I don't even know how many I caught, but I know I do know I got four keepers. How many keepers did you get, Matt? Uh, two. You got two keepers. Two. John, well then. I got five keepers. Yeah, okay. whatever. <laughs> I'll take that money and put it to good use, filling my stomach. Yeah, we're gonna go eat. So I guess it don't matter what what size keepers we got, because you only got two. I got four. I got we know what you're not doing. That's why I wanted to do a total. But uh, yeah. I was gonna have you add it up. But I, ended up, catching a, it I ended up catching a 13, yeah. 7, 5, 13 and a half. 12 and a quarter and a 21 and a half. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> 12 and a quarter. And that's oh, my dang. four. Four keepers, that's 51, it. 51, 7, 5. Boom, for four. That'd be great for three. I hope I beat that <laughs> this coming up weekend on Chick you, you, with three. You I, have to, I better yeah, beat oh, yeah. that. I better have like 53 inches, I hope. 16. 16, big fish. Uh, that was the first one I caught. Dang. 12 and a half, 13 and a half, 14 and a half. Yeah, and Heck then- that, He's already got me beat, 56. I got 15 and a half. Dang. 72 inches. Took our money. Let's yeah. hand, hey, we're gonna what, hand it over. What we're amazing, over. but thank Look. you. Appreciate the contribution. <laughs> thank you. Yeah. <laughs> he, knew he, was, he knew he had this. All right, good. guys, make sure you subscribe to John's channel. Hit that subscribe button, hit that like button. Share this video so his channel continues to grow so you can hit that 200,000 mark. Yeah. Good God. <laughs> 200,000 Thanks for watching. Yeah. <laughs> hey, yeah. be sure to like and subscribe on mine as well, guys. Oh, yeah. Peace. You can do your outro, John. All right, man. That was a fun day. Thanks uh, for meeting up with these guys. And uh, of course, I'm with Josh all the time. And Matt, you have a channel? What, what's going on here? Uh, looking for Lunkers. That's your channel name? Yeah. Looking for Lunkers? Yeah. Okay. Right. I'm going to have to go check it out. I haven't even seen it yet. Bass and beer. Yeah. And Bass and beer right. over here. Y'all should know Thanks me. Thanks for watching.